Just kind of the feeling coming off of last night and maybe where things went wrong for y'all. Yeah, I mean, just an opportunity that you know we missed to uh, be able to get a game at home. Obviously, you know, they, they set the tone physic physically, you know, against us. And I think it took us a little bit of time to adjust to that. Um, didn't really get the stops that we needed to to get the win. A familiar feeling for you guys in terms of having one of those slip away and maybe not look your best? Yeah, I mean, we're, you know, still trying to find consistency. I think that's, that's uh, one of our biggest challenges. You know, every, every other game right now, we feel like we've put together a good game. And every other game, um, on the flip side, um, it's been efforts like last night. So we have to clean it up mentally. When you have, like, one of these teams come in here, that ones that maybe, quote, unquote, you feel you're supposed to beat, um, does that just add a little bit more pressure to you guys given the season you've had? No, I don't think it's that. I think it's just finding that level of uh, intensity you know, every single night. You know, we, it's, it's always easy, like I said, to, to, for teams to get up to play a team that's, you know, quote unquote, ranked higher than you or, or you know, maybe has different matchups, players out there or whatever. But, you know, it's like, can we replicate that every single night? You know, we, we did that against you know, Minnesota or the Clippers or, you know, the Lakers. And we didn't do it against Denver, you know, Houston. You know, teams like that. So it's just like, how do you continue to define that consistency? Have you been able to pin, pin down why you guys are performing better on the road than at home? I mean, there's nothing specific. I mean, obviously the numbers, you know, are, are, are black and white in terms of we do play better on the road than at home, but nothing specific that jumps out. And how important is it to improve that, that home record in this final show? It's big because we, we have a lot of games at home. Um, at the end of the day, I don't think I've been on a, a team that plays that much better on the road than at home, but it's something that you know we have to we have to get better at, and you, know, you have home games in the playoffs too, right? So it's like gotta gotta win those. Yeah, so when you see the team kind of going through these quote unquote growing games or inconsistencies throughout the season um, against opponents uh, that maybe you feel like you should win or vice versa, as the veteran on on this squad, you've seen a lot, you've been through a lot throughout your years in the league. How much do you take it upon yourself to kind of just say, you know, I've been there, guys, and just kind of, I guess, accept that leadership role in the locker room? I think for us, like I said, it's really just a matter of our mentality. It's not necessarily a matter of, you know, do we need to go out here and prove ourselves because we've done that, you know what I mean? It's just a matter of, okay, if we did that 48 hours ago, you know, why do we have these these laws? Why do we have this inconsistency? Or why does it take us a while to, uh, you know, play harder in the games in the third and fourth quarter in different stretches? So I think for us, especially when we get a lead, I think maintaining that same focus, maintaining what we've been doing um, has been our biggest challenge. You guys play really fast, but do you think like slowing down the pace when you have that lead is is beneficial at all? It's really just valuing the possession. And not necessarily slowing it down. I think a lot of times people think, okay, you get a lead, you should slow it down and try to work more the clock. But for us, as long as we're taking good quality shots, even if they're earlier in the shot clock, we're fine. It's just the turnovers fuels them, allows them to get back into the game. Um, it makes it just more difficult. It's like, you know, you talk a lot about how you guys want to finish and obviously finish going into a postseason on a high note. How much of it is having to stay out of that play-in scenario versus accepting maybe, hey, if we're there, we're there, control what you can control? I mean, at the end of the day, you, you got to see everybody. You know, whether it's in the sixth seed or the seventh seed or whatever it is, you're in the plan, you're not in the plan. Like, we're going we're gonna to see these teams. So I think for us, at the end of the day, it's a matter of how we're playing coming into the postseason, whatever it is form or fashion we're there and just knowing that a lot of these things that are plaguing us right now whether it's turnovers whether it's slow starts whether it's uh, giving up leads whatever it is like these are things that are going to uh, we don't want these to be recurring things coming into the playoffs and Mike had talked a little bit about over the past five or so games how the spray action isn't quite there what are you seeing I don't know if you guys feel that at all but do you see anything uh, replacing that during those moments where the spray isn't there yeah, I mean, I think uh, last couple games, the team has done a good job of just packing the paint. And I think just our ability to, you know, we have a lot of guys who can not finish, make spectacular plays, things like that. But, you know, really just making the extra pass. I think that's that's one of our biggest things. And or not playing crowds that turn the ball over. I think those are probably our two biggest areas where we can improve. And if you think of all those turnovers, if they're just simply just missed shots, or we can have floor balance, get back and set our defense and be fine. I think that changes in the outcome of some of these games. Last time you guys played Milwaukee, close loss on the road. What stands out to you when they come into town tomorrow? I mean, they're going to they're play physical. Um, and obviously, you know, Dame, Giannis, you know, they're, um, 
know, going to be a lot offensively. But for us, I thought you know, we, we played the game that we wanted to. Obviously, we played with free throws um, in that game, but uh, I thought you know, we, were, we were right there. Thanks, sir.